Howdy, future farmers and math whizzes. Welcome to our math adventure, down at the farm. I'm Mark, and today we're diving into the wonderful world of numbers with the help of some farm friends. Math is all around us, from the stars in the sky to the petals on a flower. It helps us measure, count, and understand the world better. We can measure how tall we are, how long a road is, or how much we've grown. Isn't that awesome? Look at these symbols. They're like tools in our farm toolbox. This first one, the equal sign, is our trusty farm buddy. This sign is like a balance on the farm. It shows us if both sides have the same amount. Imagine we have three apples on one side and three apples on the other. What do we see when we use our equal sign? Three apples equals three apples, making both sides balanced. Well done. Now folks, let's talk about the plus sign. It's like the sunshine on a farm. It helps us add things together, just like the tractor helps plow the fields. Imagine we have one tractor and another one just like it. When we put them together, it's like counting up all our tractors. Let's imagine we have one big tractor and another tractor, just like this. When we put them together, we count them up, and guess what? One tractor plus one more equals two tractors. Wow. Plus, you are magical. But hold your horses. What if we have to take things? That's where our next farm math friend comes in. This sign, the minus sign, is like a farm tool. It helps us take things or find out how many are left. Let's say we have three cute sheep on the farm and one goes out for a little walk. How many are left? Hmm, correct. Two sheeps. So, in mathematical terms, we can say that three sheep minus one sheep leaves us with two adorable furry friends. Wow, the minus sign is so cool. All right, let's put our farm math skills to work. Here are some easy examples using our farm tools. In each example, the first number shows what we start with. The math sign plus or minus tells us what to do, adding more or taking some away. And the second number shows what happens next. It's like playing with our farm friends and seeing how their numbers change when they join or leave the group. Good. Now that we know which signs will help us on our farm adventure, we can embark on two rounds of fantastic farm math fun. In round one, we'll add friends to the farm, and in round two, we'll see what's left. Are you ready for this farm math adventure? Let's explore the farm, add some friends, and discover what's left behind in these two incredible rounds of farm math. In round one, we're adding things together, just like we're gathering friends on the farm. This addition sign, plus, helps us count how many farm tools and animals we can collect. Let's see what amazing groups we can create. Imagine we have a big red tractor and another one like this. When we count them together, we end up with two tractors. So we can say that one tractor plus one tractor equal two tractors. Amazing work. What other fantastic farming tools might we discover in the following example? Let's explore more. Picture, three friendly cows munching on grass. Now, two more cows join them, making a happy herd of five cows in total. So we can say that three cows plus two cows equal five cows. Great counting. What other delightful farm animals might we meet in the next example? Let's find out together. Two ducks are swimming in the pond. Join them with four more ducks, and we'll have a lively group of six ducks. So we can say that two ducks plus four ducks equals six ducks. Amazing counting. Round two brings us subtraction minus, where we see how many are left after some farm friends wander off. It's like solving a mystery of what's left behind after some things go away. From horses to chickens, apples and sunflowers, each subtraction reveals the farm's changing scene and teaches us what remains. Let's say we have a field with six beautiful horses. If two of them trot, we are left with four horses grazing happily. So, in mathematical language, we can say that six horses minus two horses equals four horses. Wow, so that's four horses left. Well done. I wonder what other friendly animals will join our farm adventure in the next example. Imagine a basket with five beautiful eggs. We want to make an omelet with five eggs, so we will need five eggs from the basket. Hmm, but then the basket will remain empty. So, in mathematical language, we can write like this. Five eggs minus five eggs equals zero eggs. 
That is, we are left with no eggs. Interesting, isn't it? Are you ready to practice your addition and subtraction skills? Put on your thinking caps, because here's the math. Solve these farm-tastic calculations, and those who get it right within 10 seconds will receive the awesome Little Mathematician Medal. Ready, set, calculate. The 10 seconds have passed. Did you calculate? Let's see the correct answers together. Eight apples minus three apples equal five apples, correct. Two cows plus four cows equal six cows, correct. Three chicken minus two chicken equal one chicken, correct. Wow, you calculated very well. Congratulations, you got the gold medal. Remember, these signs help us perform different operations in math, making it easier to work with numbers and solve problems. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to Mark's channel for more exciting math adventures on the farm. Your support helps us grow and bring more fun learning experiences to you. Bye-bye, little mathematician.